Hello and good day. Welcome to our video channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be a fast concise overview, the book, Song of Solomon, Chapter 5. Let's get started now. The Song of Solomon, also known as the Song of Songs, is a beautiful and passionate love poem between a man and a woman. Chapter 5 of this book continues the theme of the lover's relationship and offers lessons on love, desire, and commitment. The chapter begins with the woman dreaming that her beloved is knocking at her door, but she is too tired to get up and let him in. When she finally does, he has gone. She searches for him, but he is nowhere to be found. She asks the city guards to help her find him, and they mistreat her, causing her to lament her lover's absence. The first lesson we can take from this chapter is the importance of being responsive to our loved ones. The woman is too tired to get up and let her beloved in, and as a result he leaves. It's important to make time for our partners and show them that we value them. Small gestures like greeting them when they come home, listening to them when they talk, and being physically affectionate can make a big difference in a relationship. The second lesson is the importance of communication in a relationship. The woman in the story assumes that her lover will always be there and doesn't make an effort to communicate with him. When he leaves, she is left feeling alone and abandoned. It's important to communicate our needs, desires, and fears to our partners, and to listen to them when they communicate with us. This helps to build trust, intimacy, and a sense of security in the relationship. The third lesson is the importance of commitment. The woman in the story is committed to finding her lover, despite the mistreatment she receives from the city guards. She is willing to go to great lengths to be reunited with him. In the same way, it's important to be committed to our partners and to the relationship. This means being faithful, supportive, and dedicated to the well-being of the relationship. Finally, the chapter reminds us of the power of physical attraction and desire in a relationship. The woman dreams of her beloved knocking at her door, and her heart longs for him. This desire and attraction are natural and healthy parts of a relationship, and they can help to keep the passion alive. It's important to nurture these feelings and express them in healthy ways, such as through physical affection and intimate communication. In conclusion, Chapter 5 of the Song of Solomon offers valuable lessons on love, desire, commitment, and communication in a relationship. By being responsive to our partners, communicating effectively, remaining committed, and nurturing our physical attraction and desire, we can build strong, fulfilling relationships that last a lifetime. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible chapter below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back here for our next video. Always take good care.